Right guys, Matt and Oscar checking in to a soggy Salisbury. So we're going to go and have a look around. Police station down here. Lots of stuff to video and take pictures of. So let's get cracking. So we've got Salisbury Cathedral. And the police station here. Bit of a funky looking place if you ask me. From what I've seen of it so far. Oscar's tangling me up again. For what it's worth, it is uh, definitely a very welcoming spot and one that if you were going to photograph police stations, this would be one you would do. Look at this out the back. If you like the coppers here, don't they? Look after them. Got themselves a garden, that'd be nice out in the summer with the donuts and what have you. Hiya. Hiya, you all right? It's a cracker, isn't it? Yeah. I was just saying, you've got the gardens and everything as well. Do you, do you sit out here in the summer and that? Yeah. It's yeah. really nice. They, um, apparently, these pillar things are something to do with like, thermal efficiency or something. Ah, right. So um, they're, uh, it's not just for a not unusual design then. It does actually do something. Yeah, they're meant to trap light. When was the building made then? Is it recently? I not, you know what I mean when I say recent. I mean the last uh, yeah. you know, 20, 30 years or something. Yeah, I don't think it's very old. I don't know yeah. exactly how old it is, but it's yeah, within the last 10 years. It's quite a yeah, new building. Yeah. yeah, apparently these are something to do with shade and sunlight. and. All oh, right, I see. Whatever. You hear the water draining in there and stuff like that. Yeah, oh, very good. Yeah. Oh, right, yes, right. it is. It's a nice spot. I'm just having a look round. Nice with the garden. Yeah, too. I can imagine in the summertime. Better, yeah, better in the summer. A cracking place to eat your donuts, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Not that we any time to do that, but, yeah. All right. Hey, nice one, guys. See you later. Yeah, obviously uh, proud of the police station as well. A couple of nice bobbies there. Very good. Imagine if you were like spoke to every time you went to a police station like that. Uh, and they had a bit of crack with you. They could have quite easily just ignored us or asked what do you think you're doing, but yeah, they get it. They get it. Alright, I'll go down here and have a nosy, then we'll go and get some marked cars. Could be a full on pass here unless someone comes in and the uh, station clown and spoils it, so stay tuned. Maybe all this uh, prettiness outside the station and the station itself is why they're all so cheery. I think I'd be a lot happier if I worked here than a lot of the ones. I did see a squirrel up there, but it's disappeared. You know what I'm like with my squirrels. Another bobby just come in. Restricted area. Cool. Every police station was like this. Maybe we'd have a lot better. Coppers out there. 
more happy go lucky. It definitely wins police station of the year for appearance anyway. Right, let's go and check out these marked cars. Let's hope it doesn't get spoiled last minute as so often happens. Right, stay tuned. Um, I just like what I do, just like pictures of like the marked cars and stuff. Sorry? It's just like what I've picked pictures of like the, the marked vehicles and what have you. Okay, it's just that yeah. obviously they're police cars, so I've got a concern to why you're taking photos of those, that's all. Um, yeah, it's just like, just for like stuff I'll sit and do that and that, and just like pictures and what have you. Okay, alright. Can I just take your name then, fella? Um, I, I just tend not to give me details out. It's just like if I do this, like do pictures of them, that it's like each time someone asks at a, a police station and what have you, um, it's like I don't, just don't want to keep going through the system and that, that's all. So I just tend to not give me details out just for that reason. It's now other than that. Um, it's like I say, it's just I'm getting a couple of pictures of the. Okay, uh, well, can you show me what you've just taken the pictures of then? Um, uh, it's just of the car. The Let's have a look then. I'll get a log there. Yeah. It's just, well, we are in a police yeah. station. It's a secure car park to where we park our vehicles. I just, I asked thought, you it was just a, I just it. thought it was a normal uh, car park. No, it's not. All right. No, it isn't. So that's why I want to ask why you're taking photos of our police vehicles. It's not, not a thing everybody does every day, that's all. All right, yeah. Yeah, I just do it all over. I've just been... Uh, on my way back from Southampton, heading back up to Manchester, so it's like... I so where have you come from now then? Uh, Southampton. What, walking your dog from Southampton? Yeah. Where's your vehicle then? Why? Well, it's a long way to walk with a dog from Southampton. He, he loves going for a walk. Yeah, but Southampton's a very long way, mate. That's like 40 minutes away in a car. Uh, we have like, just do it bit by bit, like different stops and what have you. Pardon? Just like do different stops and what have you. Okay. And take a break. Well, have you got any ID on you then? Um, I don't know. I don't carry ID. You don't, and you don't live here. In no. Salisbury. You don't. Okay. Yeah, I'm just, it's quite a shame. You, you do know that if you refuse details to a police officer, that is an offence under Section 50. No. What What you've just said is an offence under Section 26. It's 50 as well. No, no, no. What you've just said is an offence under Section 26 well, of the Criminal Justice. Well, relay that to me then and tell me why. If you're telling lies, making up the law, twisting the law to obtain details, that's yeah. using your powers okay, to I'm suit your own powers. personal details. I'm using my powers because you're you've taking just, pictures You've just said if cars. I refuse to give my details, which I don't have to do. Okay, I've turned my camera on, okay? Right. So the evidence protects myself and for you. Right. Okay? Yeah. So I'll ask you again. Why are you taking pictures of police vehicles? Because I feel like it. Okay. Okay. So, I'm going to check that with one of my officers. You can check it with whoever you want. I'll you. Thank you. You've I've got, got your camera you. on. You've got your camera on. I can this see myself. This has gone from me asking you for your details. You've just committed a section 26 of the criminal no, justice. I have yes, not. you have. These two are here to I've got it. I've well, I've got it on details. here. I've yes, got it on here, Chuck. You've committed a section 26 and I've got it on camera. Hello, sir. Why is she just committed a commit section 26? Could sir. you answer that? Is that a unit coming that? Yeah, I've got it. Um, hello, sir. We've been quite nice and amicable with you. We've just no, you haven't. Right, sir. The two chaps that went in the sir. police building have been nice and amicable with sir. me. Sir. You haven't. Can I, can I, right. I'm not doing anything so, wrong. I'm taking pictures of the police cars because I'm allowed to do it. She's just committed a section 26 right. and I want to know why. Right. Because I've asked you can for I, your details. That's not a reason. Sir, sir, I don't have to give you my details. C6130. I don't have to give me details. Sir. End of story. Yeah. Okay, well that might be the end of your story. It is. It'd be the end of your story if I choose so choose as well okay. if I walk away. Okay. Yeah? Sir. Okay. Right. This is a police car park. 
Okay. Is it a private allowed to use it as well? Right. No, the private can't use the, this car park. They can't, the can they not? The, Sir, there. the private car park is down there, okay? It is defined by the markings on the floor, lease bays only, okay? Right, lease yeah. Vehicles, right? We okay. just have a slight concern of the reasons why you're taking the bit, pictures of, the vehicle, of our vehicles. That's all. There's no, there's no offences to be taken. Anyone can take a picture of a police car. Can you tell just, her that? Right. We just that have wasn't a concern. What I was asking you, it's for your name and address. Sir. Right, well, there's no need for it. I'm talking, okay? We just have a concern of why you're taking pictures of the police cars. So we just want to make sure that you're legitimately who you say you are and that I never said who I was. For a lawful reason, that's all. Okay? What would be an unlawful reason? No, what? Said lawful, a lawful reason. So, what would be an unlawful right, reason for so, taking a picture so of a police car? Talking, yeah, go on. Okay. I'm just asking you. That's all. all you I just want said to it. Know is, is it you're doing it legitimately for a hobby? Because there are people that have it as a hobby, taking pictures of a police car, mm -hmm. and then we have people doing it for YouTube and all sorts. Are you a YouTuber? Um, I've got a YouTube channel, but not much on it. Okay. Um, is that so, not? Is that unlawful then? If it's for YouTube? No, no, no. no. I'm not saying it's all unlawful. Right. I'm saying that people do do it as a hobby and stuff. Yeah. But there's also people that are out there that do it for other reasons which are probably not very nice and we want to make sure taking pictures of a police right. car for reasons sir, that aren't very could you just sir, clarify you've sir, lost me right. you've lost me there are people that will take pictures for like counter-terrorism that sort of thing and we want to make sure our vehicles are safe and the public are safe counter-terrorism okay. against a Vauxhall Astor police car yeah but i don't know why you're t taking the pictures okay so what we've asked you don't need to know why find out your details just make sure you're you're being a legitimate citizen right okay because this you're going around taking I, 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 listen the only one that's committed a crime is this lady okay. here okay. she's just committed well, an offense moment, under section right. 26 of the criminal justice act i've got it all on camera and it'll be going to the head, head office i want to know why she's done it What's, what's she's, going on there? Sorry, she's blatantly lied on camera, saying that I have to give so me what's, details. What's happened today, then? What, I... I've come down, I've taken some pictures of the garden, the police station and the vans. Okay. She's come out and demanded ID. I didn't demand. You said that I have to, under section, what was it, 50? 50. So she's just admitted it. Okay. And what, what's your name? Are you... Uh, no, I won't. No, you don't. That's fine. This no. is completely up to you. Obviously, we, whenever someone starts sort of taking pictures of what we do, we're a bit sort of... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Do you need the police for anything at all? I don't know. You don't, okay? Oh, well, you're... maybe to report this lady here. Well, you've got my number. So I have, yeah. You're yeah. free to go, sir. So you can... I know I'm free to go. I was yeah. never detained anyway. That's no problem. So right. We'll leave you to it. Yeah. Okay. You should have left me to it in the first place. There's no crime being committed taking pictures of a police car. You, you don't need to know why. You don't start demanding details and ID because someone's taking. You, you did. You said under section fifty. That's near as damn it as a demand you're going to get. That's a threat. Well, you're obviously used to that behaviour. No, I'm not. I'm used to the right, behaviour that. The... Go, so you've been told that you haven't got to stand here and talk to us anymore. Right. Well, maybe I want to. Maybe I'm lonely. <laughs> Do you mind if I just follow you in and get a little video for YouTube? It's all the. It's called the walk of shit. You can't stop me. Listen, so I've got a lot of problem with what you're doing. You've you taking pictures and videos. I've got, and not got a problem with you either. You've been decent right from the start. As of the two gents that went in, I was having a talk with them for a couple of minutes and they were spot on. Okay. But this one's got a real stinky attitude. Leave this lady some comments, guys. Tell us, tell her what you think of her Section 26 she's committed. Tell her how naughty she is. You'll, uh, you'll never make a real police lady, will you? You never make a real police lady, will you? Plastic. Keep an eye out for yourself, won't you? I reckon 100,000 views on this one. You've just spoiled it for the two nice guys that I had an interaction with. I had a good interaction with two nice blokes. Fair enough. Look, I, I can, I she was being a douchebag. Okay, I understand what you're doing yeah. and, and what you want to do, which you can do. Um, and and, and that's, that's the end of the story, pretty much, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so you, you, can, you can do what you're doing. Are you doing police auditing? Or? It is, yeah. It is? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So it was going great. And I even said when I came out of there after speaking to them too, I said, I hope no one else spoils it. And lo and behold... 
she came out and she started threatening me with section 50 if I don't give me details, blah 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 simply because I took a picture of the van when it came in there's no need for it, there really isn't I'm always alright with people you'll see that at the start of the video when it goes up you'll see I'm totally alright with them but if someone starts being silly then they're going to get shown up Okay, no alright. Yeah, yeah, no, I'll stop Cheers. Like I say, I've got no problem with you. You've been spot on from the minute I seen you, alright? Yeah. Alright, cheers, buddy. No Catch you later, you too. That chap at the end there was alright. So. He knew it was an audit. So, yeah, that guy there was alright. Little lady with the attitude, little plastic with the attitude, eh? Committing a section 26. Oh, she, her ego was coming out to play then, wasn't it? Blimey. She thought she was someone, didn't she, until she got shot down. Uh, right, I'm going to video this chap coming out and leaving, and then we're going to head off. So, you know, you want to stay for the video of the police car leaving, that's what we'll come for, so stick around and watch the action. Got a wave there off that chap. Appreciated, generally is. So it should be every time. Right guys, Matt and Oscar checking out. I'll catch you next time with another audit. Um I was gonna say something but I can't think now. It's gone. Right, yeah, anyway. Uh yeah, catch you next week with another audit guys. See you later.